Maybe there is a way out there. They want Philippa Martinez. Let's give them Philippa Martinez. Huh? I'm not sure that I follow you. You become Philippa Martinez, and we'll be your family. <laughs> I could make a sign. Free alterations on clothing purchases are personally supervised by our, uh, by our in-house fashion designer, Danielle. <laughs> <laughs> and by the way, you're not on trial anymore, so welcome oh, aboard. Oh, thanks, man. <laughs> I'm in love with him. In love? With Rob. I know it's happened all so quick, but everything just fell into place. He's so wonderful. And I can't leave him. I'm in love with Rob Evans. Bad hair day. No, just lots to do. Obviously enjoying it. Yep. The, the truth is, I'm just, I'm trying to enjoy it, you know, to keep my mind occupied. Mm. I can relate to that. Oh, yeah, you've got your camera session tomorrow, huh? Hey, yeah, gee, I totally forgot. Hey, look, I won't mention that if you don't mention Brett. Deal. But you know you can always talk to me if you need to. Thanks, there's not much to talk about. I just, I can't help thinking about all the rows we've had. You know, the amount of times that I told him I was going to kill him. Hey, hey. Brothers and sisters always carry on like that. Yeah, I know. And if anyone can get him out of this trouble, it's your mum, right? Right, so let's just shut up and, uh, and start work. What do we need to do? Oh, oh look, there's nothing personal, like, but I really don't think you know the first thing about dressmaking. I could learn. You could teach me. Okay, well, maybe you can go down to the shop for me, all right? This dress needs reshaping. I need a mannequin. A mannequin? Mm-hmm. Well, use me. Seriously. And unlike a certain supermodel neighbour of ours, I won't even charge for the privilege. <laughs> What's this? You're doing a sad bit. Mm -hmm. Jade's reliving her last moments with David. Oh, how sad. That is beautiful, Dad. Now, no, don't mock your father's sensitivity. All great writers have to put themselves in the shoes of their characters. I wasn't mocking him. Weren't you, darling? It sounded like it. Did it? Oh, well, fair enough. After all, I am the insensitive one around here, aren't I? Home wrecker, shameless hussy. Is that what Rosemary told you? Debbie, just a minute. Debbie? <sighs> Did I provoke that? Hardly. Don't worry, Gran. She gets a bit touchy every now and then. It's time we had a talk, I think. The, the sooner the better. I've got enough stress to deal with at the moment. I thought the book was going well. The book is. Philip is not. Oh, not that again. Oh, gentle Helen, I beseech thee. Only you can save me from this terrible plight. How could one so fair deny me this, my humble request? Mm -hmm. Ow! Oh, well then, would you stay still? Well, it's this stupid thing. Oh, would you stop whinging? You were supposed to be a dummy, not spit the dummy. Now turn around. Look! <laughs> Cut it out. Alrighty. Not bad at all. Okay, stop, stop. Look, this is supposed to be a sexy little cocktail number. You can do better than that. That's it. Strap your st <laughs> Oh, Deb. Right. Yeah. Hi. What do you think? Um, I think you look exhausted. And you ought to know better. He's supposed to be resting, not poncing around in your latest little creation. Deb, ease up. It was my idea. That's not the point. You should be preparing yourself for tomorrow. Look, Deb's right, you should get changed. I'll prepare dinner. If it's all right with you two, I'll decide what's right for me. Now, why don't you make yourself beautiful and help Danny with his hem? A little shorter, darling, what do you think? Yeah, sure. Truth now, do I look fabulous or what? Oh! Oh, what on earth is that? Chinese herbs, I picked them up after school. You meant to drink it. Oh, and that's supposed to be good for you? Cleanses the blood and restores the yin-yang balance. Excuse me? Gives you energy. Oh, 
I hope there's nothing illegal in there, is there? Oh, Mum. Well? No scouts on her. Here you go. Are you sure about this? Working already. I feel great. 